In these problems, we're being asked to convert a percentage into a fraction, and then they want it in the simplest form. So we'll have to see if we can reduce the fraction. The thing to know about percentages is that they're all out of 100. So any percent, you can put it on the top of a fraction over 100. This means that 75% is 75 out of 100. We're not done, though, even though we have a fraction, because this can be reduced. Um, I've, I've got 75 on top, 100 on the bottom. Both of those are divisible by 5 for sure. So 100 divided by 5 is 20. And 75 divided by 5 is 15. So we've got 15 20s. Uh, it looks like those are still both divisible by 5. So 15 divided by 5 would be 3. 20 divided by 5 would be 4. And I think that's as small as we can get, because those are both prime numbers. So 75% is 3 fourths. That makes sense. 75 cents is 3 quarters. All right, let's try one more. So we've got 80%. We want to write this as a fraction in simplest form. Any percent can be written as that number over 100. So this is 80%. This is 80 over 100. I can definitely divide both by 10 to start with, and I get 8 over 10. Both of those are still divisible by 2, so let's do that. 8 divided by 2 is 4. 10 divided by 2 is 5. And I think that's the simplest term you can get there. So 4 fifths is the same as 80%. That's a little work with converting percentages to fractions.